Hello again, this is Oliver and welcome back to yet another video, short video where I explain different analysis techniques for Sudoku. If you like my videos, be sure and give me the thumbs up and you might think of subscribing as well, be greatly appreciated. I want to show you a technique, an advanced technique for finding chains, singles chains in a puzzle. Now this is a puzzle, it is number 074 in my advanced series and they're virtually all based on diabolical Sudokus from the Telegraph newspaper. Now I put a link there for part one which brought us to this particular stage where we had used the basic techniques to clear out as much as possible and now we needed to, to use advanced techniques. And in particular, I wanted to find a chain. So um, what we should, can say first, any place where there's three colors, and these were for uh, doubles, it means that there was a double in a house, it's a 2828. It was also linked in the row over to there and was also linked in the column. So there were two and the eight had what we call strong links. And down below as well, you're going to find a tutorial explaining what strong and weak links are. And there's also a tutorial there on singles chains. So have a look at those and then come back here and let's see the technique that I usually do when I'm really stuck and I just can't find a chain. And this is also for um, one of our subscribers, Doc Sardo, who's wondering, he was stuck at this one, he's wondering how do you find a chain? Okay, well what I do first is I get a blank sheet of paper with a Sudoku blank puzzle on it and I start filling in whatever one I'm thinking of and I'm thinking that the twos, there's a lot of twos around here, quite a lot of them and I want to find is there a possible chain on the twos. Right, so now here I've transposed the twos, all the possible twos onto this blank sheet of paper and any place where there's a strong link I put a circle around the two points of that strong link and I have a line on the circle showing where the, the link is. So for example, this one here I'm saying is a strong link and it's linked with this one here because there was only there were the only two places for two in the house and it was also linked down here because there were the only two places for two in the column. So for example, the two here is strong linked over to that one and it's also strong linked down to this one. So you do that first, put in all your strong links. And if you don't know about strong and weak links, there is, as I said, there's a tutorial down below where you can go and have a look at strong, weak links. Now, this is an interesting one because there are three twos here. We do not have a strong link here. We only have a weak link. All right. So you must understand strong and weak links. Now, then I go around all the different twos. And I see, well, is there a start and an end that has a circle on it? And the reason I'm saying that is because every chain must start and end with a strong link. And every of these, we call them pencil circles or biro circles, we know that they are strong links. The red ones here are just markers that I'm going to show. For example, there's a, we could go from here to here and that would get rid of that one if we can. If we could go from here to here, we could get rid of that one. If we could go from here to here, we get rid of that one. I'm just saying where the start and end chains would have to be. Here and here, we get rid of that one. And here and here, we get rid of that one. So all these other twos, forget about them. They're not going to be of any use to us, not for a singles chain. So it's just those three there, that one and this one here. So for that one, we have to go from here to here. Well, is there a pathway from here to here? Well, there is, there's a simple one. Go from there to there to there. So that is a chain. Now, is it a valid chain? Well, if you look at uh, the tutorial down below on chains, you'll see that you always have to start and end on a strong link. Strong link, strong link, great. The other thing is you must need three links and we only have two links. So not valid. And why is it not valid? Well, if you start here saying there's no two there, then there is a two here, then there's no two there. So what does that tell us about this? Absolutely nothing. All right. For a chain to be valid, you must start off with it not being true and then you must end up with it being true. So forget about that one. It is, we cannot 
work a chain into that. Now, let's try this one here. So if we start here, we could go off, on, off, on, off. No good. We started off, ended an off, and that's because we have an even number of links instead of an odd number of links. So forget about that too, which means we only have three twos here now that we that are possible for us to get rid of. Now for this one here, we're going to have to start or end here and here. If we start off here, now this is where we have to understand strong weak links. If that is off, that is on. Now if that is on, this is off, so we're still in a, a chain. If that is off, that is on. If that is on, that is off. If that is off, that is on. We can get rid of that too. To prove it, we go the other way around. Off, on, off, on, off, on. We can get rid of that too. What about this one here? Well, for that one, these are going to be the start and end of the chain. So we can go off, on, off, on, off. No good. We start with off, we end with off. What about this one here? It's going to be start here, end here. Or there are two ends. Off, on, off, on, off, on. So we started off, we ended on. There's our intersection. We should be able to get rid of that. And to prove it, go the other way around. Off, on, off, on, off, on. So we see now that there are two possibles that we can get rid of with this very, very simple technique. I'll just show it to you. I'll just give you another example now on the same puzzle where we look at the eights. Right, here is the same puzzle. And, and now I've uh, written out all the eight possibles. And we want to find out if there is any chains and what we can delete. And I've actually found the ones, anything marked with in a green square. They're ones that I reckon we can get rid of. Now, so let's go and start from the top. Um, first one is we'll take it over here this one down here to get rid of that we'd have to start here and end either here or here well if we start here we can do off on off on but then we come up here and it's an off so that's not a valid chain so we can't get rid of that one this one over here to get rid of that we could start here and end over here now we just do off on and we can't really go any further we can that's on so all of these are off but that doesn't link into a strong link after that so this one we can't get over to here this one here now we could go from here to here except again there's no link across this way there's not a strong link this way there's only a weak link so we can't do anything with that this one here now this is a different one if we could go from here to here and now it doesn't look possible when you look at it first because it seems as if sorry about that I was trying to print another blank page and there's something wrong with the printer what was I doing this one here okay but don't forget strong weak links we only have to have a strong link on the first one as in off on but now we can jump over it this way so we've got off on off on off on started off here ended on here so you might have missed that one that means we can get rid of this eight here for this one here if we start here there's no ending one that also targets that place so we can't do anything with that one over here this one here we'd have to start here and end here here that would target that and it would also target this one so if we can get that we get two for the price of one so let's try and do that starting here off on off on off on so we got a weak link there but that's okay on 
and that targets this one so we can get rid of both of those this one there's nothing we'd have to go from here to here and to do that we could do off on off on off on off so we start off we end off we couldn't get rid of that one and up here in the top it didn't look good because if we tried it this way off on off but that would be targeting targeting the two of them that won't work but there is another way of doing it and that is off on off on off on so starting there and ending here we can target this one and get rid of that one all right now i hope you've followed all those this is just a nice way when you're really really stuck get a blank piece of paper and put out each one of your possibles first try and see are there any nice simple chains now if that fails then you need to go to ross's one which is uh video number 29 and i'll put a link to that as well uh, that's there in the comments all right so look i hope this has uh cleared up some things for you um <laughs> that's it <laughs> For those of you who are following the series, uh, number 74 will be coming out in a day or two. All right. Uh, so till we meet again, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you can. And Slán Tamil.